Our soldiers often wondered where Sargon had actually come from. Some believed that he had descended from heaven like the founder of Kish. Others said that he was an orphan who had been found in a basket floating on the Euphrates. I have even heard some townsmen say that he was the son of a priestess who had given birth without having ever lain with a man. Sargon only smiled at these rumors. He said that it does not matter where a man comes from, only where he goes, and that he himself follows the path that Ishtar shows him. That path led to war. With Kish subdued, Sargon sent his army to conquer the countless city-states of Mesopotamia in Ishtar's name. The masters of these cities scoffed at Sargon's ambitions, yet secretly, they all feared him. In order to match Sargon's army, they joined forces under the leadership of Lugal Zagisi, the priest killer. He was a brutal man, feared for his atrocities across the region. He would often desecrate the temples of the cities that he conquered. Yet, he was a capable tactician and a gifted commander. A suitable challenge for Ishtar's champion. The city-states of Mesopotamia lie before us. They are loyal to Lugal Zagisi, but they will follow Ishtar's call after seeing her artifact. This is the cart carrying the artifact. Really? We should task soldiers to guard it at all times so that the artifact does not fall into the wrong hands. Our scouts report seeing some unclaimed villages in this area. We shall add them to my growing empire. Alamal, 
Sama lah mah. Zombies. 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 We have constructed a market in this village. As long as it remains standing, the inhabitants will pay tribute to us. The inhabitants of Shusha realize that their resistance is futile, for mortals cannot defy the divine will. They will join our cause. Think you are Sargon, oh, a holy yes. man? As far as I know, you have only pushed the senile old man from his throne. Do not make the mistake of considering me such a pathetic figure. Oh, and before I forget, I hear that you are spreading rumors among your followers that I am a cruel desecrator of temples. What exactly did you do in Sipar and Borsipa, Sargon? You're a hypocrite, not a chosen one. Alamas. 
Constructed a market in this village. As long as it remains standing, the inhabitants will pay tribute to us. The people of Nippur are in awe of our army and Ishtar's artifact. This city will not cause us any further problems. I never liked that city anyway. Untrustworthy wretches who always pay their taxes late. You are welcome to deal with them from now on. Ishtar has not called me home yet, man. Forward, let us smash our enemies. Thank <laughs> you. 
Soldiers of Isin bow to Ishtar's will and will no longer fight us. From now on, our enemies are theirs. Really? Three enemies defeated. Only one city state left. In the name of the goddess of war, we will conquer even the most stubborn. What are you waiting for, my soldiers? Victory is within reach. Men, I told you to always keep an eye on the Arta. Why is it in the hands of allied troops? Not so fast, Sargon. You might impress some frightened city militias with your cheap artifact, but not me. Prepare to fight real soldiers. The artifact is in our hands. Do not be so careless again, soldiers. Show us. Now let Only. us see if that self-proclaimed chosen one is immune to our swords and arrows. Rugged. Charge! Rugged. Well, well. We will soon find out which of us bit off more than he could chew, Lugal Zagisi. <laughs>
That was just a taste, Zargon. Next time, I will not be so merciful, but will crush you like a bothersome insect. There they run. Back to Uruk to lick their wounds. The day is ours. Oklama, Alamas. Bombus. Rockets. Erectus. Alare. Fury. Alare. Alamas. Rockets. I hear them. Erectus, evil guardian. Fury. Darai, Oklama, Oklama, Alamas, Bombus, Abadaka, We have constructed a market in this village. As long as it remains standing, the inhabitants will pay tribute to us. Constructed a market in this village. As long as it remains standing, the inhabitants will pay tribute to us.
The artifact has come to Larsa. Its residents, common farmers and rich merchants alike, are equally seized by fear and awe. They bow their heads to the goddess and to you, wise Sargon. After several bloody campaigns, the enemy coalition was crushed. The goddess of war may have enjoyed the slaughter, yet I shuddered at the piles of bodies that we left behind in her name. Still, our mission was not over. Ishtar had promised Sargon all of the land that lies between the two great rivers. But as long as Lugal Sagisi remained at large, Sargon's claim to hegemony would be challenged. As the tyrant fled southwards, our soldiers pursued him to his well-fortified capital of Uruk. There, holed up behind its walls, we began scheming once more. 